Wow, look at this beauty. Um, this is really cool. This is a fire extinguisher. Brass fire extinguisher. And you can see it's uh, embossed. It's called a Pyrene fire extinguisher. Trying to get a good angle here so you can read it better. This one has been restored. Someone took the time to polish this sucker all up. Polish it down to the brass and they may have put a clear coat on the outside. I kind of feel kind of a glossy clear coat, which is good, which means you're never going to have to polish this thing up again if they coated it. So somebody put some time into this because I have had several of these before that were not as this shiny pretty. They were brass and you always get them and you go, man, you know, I should just, I should just polish that up. What would that look like? And I get started on one and it's like, holy cow, how do people do this? Because it would have taken me a hundred years to polish every nook and cranny on this to be shiny as this is. So whoever did this had a good procedure for it or dunked it in a chemical or did something really cool. I mean, you can tell it's still original. Here's like some, some issues. There's a little piece of the weld right there that's it's a little off. It's broken. There's another one that's a little rough right there, that piece of the weld. Um, there's uh, there's a little tar there's a little clip. Well, I know what this is from. This might be from the clip that it clips on to the holding uh, carrier, and that's what this is. This came with it, and this is the original. And it's what what it is is they've sandblasted it. It was uh, normally this is all dark and a little bit tarnished and everything, but this is the original holder. Make sure it goes this way. So this this uh, fits into here, and then it clips in up there, and of course that will cause it to scrape on the handle when it's clipped in, which is why it's got these scrapes on it. But um, I got this for um, like 20 bucks, I think, which I'm, I might keep this one. I love the looks of this. Um, if not, I'm going to... Put some high high numbers on it because it's really cool that it's all clean. That's the, that's the biggest part of the deal. That this is basically a restored extinguisher, a brass extinguisher, and it looks this this good. So this is a good find, I think, you know, in my mind. So worked out good.